What's, What's up, up guys? guys? It's, it's the 4A clan. clan. We got twins here. We got Adonis over here. Adaya. And Adaya over there. I don't know what he's looking at. At the ground. Um, but, so we feel like we vlogged a lot in San Francisco. Well, in California. I just thought of San Francisco for some reason. Um, and we just kind of don't want to ruin that. You know, we were just kind of putting videos out almost every day. And they were all vlogs, and we don't want to ruin that, so we're going to try and vlog while we're at home, too. Our lives aren't as interesting while we're at home, <laughs> but we're going to just, you know, see what we can do and make out of it. Um, today we're going to be making ceviche, so it's going to be our first time making it. Like, obviously our parents like make alone. it. Our parents make it and stuff, but like, it's going to be our first time making it. So we're just going to see how that goes. We're going to go to the store real quick and buy like our last few ingredients that we need, which is just basically the shrimp, I believe. And then, um, yeah. So we'll see you guys in a little bit once we're in the car. Peep their cute outfits. By the way, that's how the, that's what that piece goes to. It's supposed to go like that. Just kidding, it's not, but. It's actually supposed to be a bib, but it looks cuter like, like this. And he likes it. Say hi, puppy. Say yeah. hi. There's a Danish just staring down at Daya. Okay, guys, so we just arrived at our local Sam's Club and we are going to do our shopping. So, Aaron got a sushi sample. Crunch roll, spicy. A spicy crunch roll. Let's see what's up. I love sushi, I love seafood. Yeah, that was good. That's really good. Babe, yeah, got a sample so you can give it to me. Okay, hold it. Alani's not the biggest fan of sushi. Uh, Alani's not a big fan of sushi, so. I used to be. She's only me. And then I got pregnant. And then I didn't eat sushi while being pregnant, so now I don't really like it. Uh, she lying. She never liked it. Yes, I did. She doesn't like that raw fish. She likes that raw meat. Yes. <laughs> uh, which one's this one? The mild? Yeah. This the well, mild. Isn't this the one that you didn't get? Yeah. He's going to try the mild now. Which one was better? Spicy for sure. You walk like I'm poop. But that's not like walking like you're poop. Yes, it is. It's walking like. Well, okay, that's how you walk when you're poop. Guys, our freaking um, our sound stuff is only like five minutes away. And before we left, they were wide awake. So I see even. And uh, look at them. Both of them. Catching them Z's. That's me, that's me, that's me. And then she falls. <laughs> My mom wants her coffee eating. Her, that. So we are on the search. The cucumbers. Oh, are those cucumbers right there? Should we get those? <laughs> You're weird. I don't know, there's only three, and what are we doing? $3.98. I don't know if we have some. Let me take one more. Can you get these? are basically like six. They're huge. Kids are those since they're just right there all alone. <laughs> <laughs> so, guys, uh, apparently, this is all we needed. I could have swore we needed more stuff, but I guess not. And if anything, then uh, I'll just have to run to the store and buy whatever else we really need. Um, Alan's over there fixing to get me. Uh, <laughs> Fixing to get me a uh, what call it? Uh, four berry Sunday. This is my favorite. Meanwhile, I'm right here just chilling with the boys. I'm 
I was so upset because uh, they didn't have my four berry sundae, so I just had to stick with the soda. Where are you going? They're going to your mom's. Oh. Uh, I thought you told me I couldn't go. Go, just go hurry. No, I um, can't go there no more. Do a U turn. No. Babe, you're not gonna go? I have to go around. Babe, you suck at driving. Get out of the car. I'm serious. Ah, sometimes I can't Well, stand. you didn't want to drive, so... I, I told you, let me drive and you didn't want to. driving, but... I told you, let me drive. Oh, no, you didn't. Ah, I hit my head. Anyways, um... Okay, guys, so we're going to her mom's house because, uh... She's just called her right now and let her know that she got a big old package. We don't know what it is. Well, not a package, like a folder or something, no? Manila. Manila? From Philippines or what? Oh, I didn't know. And uh, so, yeah. Hey okay, guys, so we're just leaving her house. Her brothers are right there. Um, and this is what it was. It was just their, what is it, the birth certificate, I guess? That's not their birth certificate. Oh, what is it? Uh, I don't know, turn it around. Doesn't it say something? No. Like at the very top? Family history. Anyways, we got the baby's footprints. A dais is a little. This is also this is a dais, by the way. And it's kind of a little. They you know, didn't get it up. all the way. But it's okay. It's still beautiful. This is a dais. Just you could just read it and then just say. And then what this is uh, Adonis's, and they got his pretty well. They had pretty big feet. They still have pretty big feet, but. Yep. So now we're just on our way home, so we can make our ceviche. They come around. They come around. <laughs> and yeah. We'll see you guys in a little bit. Okay guys, so we just arrived home and now we are going to start prepping the shrimp. I wanna wash it. So first we're gonna wash it. I should probably take the shirt off. Huh? I should have probably take the shirt off. Yeah. Okay guys, so here we have our shrimp. We'll put it to boil. There's many ways you can go about doing this. You know, you could either get raw shrimp, that's what we did. Um, and you could just boil it or you could actually just let it sit with lime like drench it in lime and uh, Just let it sit for like 40 minutes to an hour um, And it'll actually cook it, but because it takes so long we're actually just gonna boil it um, Or you could just get already cooked lime. I mean already cooked shrimp and then as, as well Let it sit in lime for a little bit, but obviously a lot less since it's already cooked and then uh, yeah But anyways, uh, we're gonna let it boil right now and then in a little bit, I actually have to go run an errand with my mom. So it'll just be a Lonnie vlogging for a little bit, but yeah. Hey guys, so we just, um, you just let it boil until it gets pink. It's all, it doesn't take too long, it shouldn't take too long. It doesn't take that long. And, and then, then you rinse it with cold water and have it in a strainer. And you just wanna rinse it with cold water so it doesn't keep cooking with the heat, you know? And after that, you're just gonna wanna Cut it. You just want to cut into small pieces, but not too small either. And you can get the that's in the towel on even better. Ridiculous, but I have to run an air right now, and I don't want my shirt to smell like. Looks like a helmet plus on. I'm gonna be here for a while, but. So I have quite a few shrimp, so both of us are chopping up, trying to get it done before I have to go for mine.
Put your guys' opinion on secrets, guys. You guys like it? You hate it? Do whatever about it? Let us know. Hi guys, so I just stopped at a stop sign and there's someone in front of me so I could record. Look at my hair, I just, whatever. I just came to the store to pick up some avocados because I don't, we don't have any and I need it. So yes, and it's just me. I left the babies at the house with their aunt. So yeah, I'll get back to you when I go into the store. Okay guys, so I just pulled up to um this store called mercado cinco de mayo and i'm going to go in but first i'm going to fix my hair because i look like i'm a crazy woman okay so here's the weird thing like well not really weird but really sad like look at my face like it doesn't look as flawless as it usually does and the reason why is because, yeah guys, I hate brushing my hair when I get out of the shower, so this is how it ends up looking literally a mess, but I'm just going to put it back into a bun. Anyways, back to my topic. Um, yeah, my face always looks like super flawless, <laughs> like in my eyes at least, and it looks really pretty. I don't ever look like, I don't know, how would I say like... I don't want to try to sound conceited, but like, I am really pleased with how my face always looks, you know? Like, my makeup. And the sad thing is, is that I have ran out of my, like, literally almost ran out of my Laura Mercier powder. Oh my gosh, look at this freaking hair. I ran out of my Laura Mercier powder. And it's so sad because I love that powder. Like, look at my face right now. Also, look at my tan. Like, what is this? Anyways, that powder is like my life. I freaking love that powder. It was like everything. It was really, it's not really expensive, but it is expensive like for a powder. So not a lot of people buy it. But like, once I bought it, I would never go back to anything since. And I had like... How would I say, like, enough for, like, half a bake today. So I literally only got to do, like, my forehead and a little bit of my under eye. But look how my nose is. It's, like, somewhat shiny. And, like, right here is kind of weird. I don't know. I just think it's really weird. And so, yeah, I'm just waiting until I buy another one. Because you can't buy it in stores over here. You have to order it online. And, like, the last time I got mine was during holiday season. And that's the only time it's ever in store. And, like, it usually says, like, you can buy it at this store, but I go there and they don't have it. You'll, they only have it online. So I just need to order it again because I am so done with my face looking oily and flawed. Like, look, you can see almost everything because I don't have my powder. Anyways, I need to go in and go get avocados because my kids are at home with their aunt. And I'm pretty sure they're hungry now, so I need to go. Okay, guys, so I just got out of the car. Now I just need to lock it. And here I am outside the store. Look at the sky. Okay guys, so I'm just driving back at the house with my avocados. Okay guys, so I'm just driving back at the house with my avocados. So, now I'm going to finish up cutting up the shrimp and then start on all the vegetables. <sighs> it seriously looks like I have friggin' lip gloss on or lipstick. I didn't get to put on lashes because Erin made me go in a hurry, but look at my freaking eyeballs. They look ugly. Okay, guys. So I just arrived back from the store and I'm going to continue to cut the shrimp. While Erin's little sister feeds the babies. So. Okay, guys, so next I cut up six lemons, six limes. Well, it's give or take because you kind of have to cover it. Yeah, so I'll probably have to cut more. So, and then I'm going to squirt it up in there. Erin already rinsed it out again. 
Stop. <laughs> okay. I can't, I'm washing dishes. How did I tell him that idea? I don't know if it's down. <laughs> Something right there. Good enough. On the on my vlog, I was crying about how I need my Lord up. Do you want to save these lines so you can eat it, or...? No, I'm no. um, oh, a big fan of them. Uh, they're not all of them. Two of them. More. And then I use this little thing. This is so... How would I say? It's so useful. <laughs> My mom was telling Alani that when I was a baby, I didn't really like toys. So I would entertain myself with bags, boxes, like household items. She said the only thing I liked was balls. <laughs> I would play with fire too. I said, Mom, I I'm on. All, my favorite things to play with, you could ask anybody, was fireworks yeah, and fire. Yeah, I'm going to take a look at the video. I had like no toys. Huh? Oh. <laughs> I was really like, I didn't get toys. Just kidding. <laughs> No, we're really spoiled, but I never really cared for toys. I had two pairs of cows. And all. <laughs> <laughs> I had two pairs of diapers in my mom would wash them. You're dumb. I would, well not diapers, but I put all those stuff. Mamá, I had to meet them for all. Me gustaba jugar con fuego. Mamá, me gustaba jugar con fuego. The boys are gonna be bad. Yeah, right? que casi la casa también. Y con la cala dentro. <laughs> so when I was uh, like uh, some kind of flat we did them for cuatro. Cinco? Cinco. Oh. Yay. I was like Same four age. or five. I was four. Oh like five. And my mom said that I was in the room or in my room and uh, I had a lighter or not. And you tried to burn down the house with the sister. Matches, do you know? I had uh, matches, and uh, <laughs> I don't know what I was doing, but I started the carpet on fire, and uh, you know the, the house almost caught on fire completely. And my sister was in here, and my mom—I don't know—I don't think my mom was home. Oh yeah, my mom was home, but I don't know where she was. But my mom always makes a joke. She says I—I I try to burn it down just because my sister is. Uh, you need way more. Yeah. So I think my mom's gonna. Might as well. Um. All right, I'm gonna try the one. Okay. Cuchara normal. Sí, ma. No. Cuchara. Cuchara. Well, you wanted to use lemon? So what do you mean about lemon? I don't know. Holy. Huh? What is she doing? <laughs> Uh...
What are you doing? Stop messing around. Uh, and then uh, <laughs> I thought it would make the other one come out more, but nope, it just exploded. Mm -hmm. Yo, look at my arm now. <laughs> what do you think about that video? I don't know, I don't think so. You can catch out my rules. So. You can hear him, he said you just want to cover it. With saran wrap or like a lid if you have a lid for whatever you put it in like the container and then you just want to let it like especially if it's still raw shrimp you just want to let it sit in your in your fridge fridge for a while if it's raw you want to let it sit there for longer if it's cooked not that long usually by the time you're done cutting the rest of the things it's ready Are you gonna get more? Okay. Okay, and then yeah, I just wanna put it in your fridge and then cut the rest of your stuff up. Okay. Are you positive? Yeah. Ma, I like to make sure some of the cilantro. <laughs> I wouldn't mind. You just sit over Especially you. You okay, well, are. I don't know how to make now. Um, for chops, steak, um, tacos. I don't know how to make everything. Huh? I don't know how to make everything. Exactly. She likes it. Yeah, but I'm not going to cook 24-7. Yes, it is. I'll cook like... 14-3 Wait That means in one day I'd have to cook it now I'll cook like one, seven I think it'll be okay Yeah I think you just wanna go crazy Just go Kinda There's like a lot of big chunks still Anyways, we'll see you right now whenever we cut up the rest of the vegetables. Okay guys, so Alani cut the cilantro, she's cutting the cucumbers. I got all the um, tomatoes done. And now I gotta cut the onion. I'll show you guys how Pro does it. How you do this, babe? <laughs> gotta cut off the rest of it. Let's see if I don't start crying. Usually I don't, but... Oof, almost got my finger. Cut these as small as possible because I mean, it's going into he really likes to have freaking big old chunks of onion. are still dry. I'm 
What's that? Pretty strong, I'm not gonna lie, but. But I'm strong. Since when? Alright. I. Just kidding, that don't really work. I'm just gonna put it right here with that tomato. By the way guys, check out this knife. It doesn't look sharp at all, but whew, that thing is sharp. Um, you want me to cut it next? Um, I'll cut them. I'll do the whole thing next. Oh, it's a tiny. Tiny, I know. I don't really know any other way to cut up avocado. I guess we shall experiment right now. Still kind of. They literally did not have any good ones at the freaking store. Ooh. What? Why are you dancing? You need a pee? Yep. Be right back. Okay, that didn't work. These are still pretty. I'm not ready yet, so I'm gonna see if I can peel it or something. This is my first time cutting avocado, like for something like this. Get out of here. This is so slimy and I'm not scared to cut myself. Yeah, they could be smaller, but it's okay. Who doesn't like avocado? Actually, guys, Halami used to not like avocado until she started dating me. No. Yeah. I used to hate avocado even when I was dating him, but then I got pregnant and all of a sudden I loved avocado. So, technically, it's still because of me because <laughs> I got you pregnant. Me. Oh, you got yourself pregnant, Virgin Mary? <laughs> Make guac. <laughs> yeah, still. Yeah. You show them a new way to make guac. 
Did see, I was gonna do that, but I didn't know. Well, when in doubt, ask me. The few things that we have cut so far looks like this. Just told me that the avocado usually goes last because it turns black when it sits for too long. Which I knew that, but I kind of forgot. <laughs> so it's kind of good that I didn't add so much. Just waiting on her to finish that. Now I'm gonna have to be super careful. I need to wash my hands like hella, hella, hella good. Right. Because I've been to I was touching the jalapenos. And you were touching onion with the babies. I didn't touch the babies. No, I'm just saying like we're gonna clean our hands really good anyways. Oh, you're yeah. touching onion, I was touching jalapeno. Did you get that? Yeah, then we're gonna add these last few ingredients, which is the cucumber, the cilantro. And the jalapenos. Hello. You just want to mix it as you go a little bit, cause <laughs> it's good. Cause if not, it's gonna not be so mixed. Oh, it looks so good. But, yeah. I think I made too much cucumber. Can you tell? 
cut this up. Then cut that to them. Then by by um, preference, you can add an, another lemon or two, just because you're gonna let this sit again in the. Give me the little squeezer. You're gonna let this sit again in Answer. the in the fridge. But you can put the rest of the cucumber. Yeah. Yeah. Or not all of it. So you're gonna let this sit in the fridge again, just so it can all absorb together. And then it'll be cooked. I'm sure that's what it looks so far. Yum. You just want to add just a little bit of again. <laughs> a little bit of clamato. My eye! Have you guys seen her look makeup at for my today? Eye. I showed my poppin', makeup. Huh? It looks ugly. It looks popping. <gasps> no, look. Bring it closer again. Look at my eye. Look at my lids on my lips. <laughs> <laughs> So you just want to add a little bit of clamato. Hold up, make sure that thing doesn't Add it to preference as well. Just, you just touch it up with like maybe half of this. Hold on. Not too much of that. Huh? Mm. Just like that much? Yeah. Yeah, huh? You can eat the rest. I'm going to touch it up with maybe half of it. Just like that. Yeah. Shows a little less than half. Just to give it a little color, a little more flavor. Mm, pour a little bit more. And then you just want to mix it around and then uh, put it in the fridge to sit. So we'll see you guys in a little bit once it's ready. Okay, guys. So I just finished washing the dishes and Erin's going to continue to wash the pot that we had the shrimp in. And I'm just going to get everything else ready so I'm just going to set up the plates and our condiments that we're going to be using you know what I never noticed freaking the fridge has such good lighting so it makes me look wider I don't know why oh there you go mm. But I get ketchup because Aaron likes ketchup with his ceviche. Coke. Don't we have another tapatio in our room? Is it still there? Huh? And one tapatio, but it's almost done. So I'm gonna get the other one from our room. So, this one's so much more fuller. Look at it. What are you doing? <laughs> Having a pre-snack. Mm. I love cheesecake. I don't like cheesecake. Only what? banana. Or pumpkin. She don't like cake, cheesecakes, cupcakes. I don't either actually. I like cheesecake. And only some cakes. I don't even know why I said I like cheesecake. I meant pie. <laughs> banana and pumpkin. <laughs> <laughs> oh, whatever. Should I take it out now or no? Yeah, it's ready. Yeah?
Okay guys, so this is how it turned out. Looking hella bomb. We have a pasta, so now we're going to eat. You guys, uh, if you guys like, you know, want to continue seeing videos like this, like, let us know. I mean, we enjoy them. We enjoy making them. For sure. Okay guys, so, um, you know, that was it for our vlog for today, making ceviche. It's pretty good. Um, anyways guys, if you guys enjoy your enjoy watching these videos, let us know. And, you know, we can continue to make these, make some Filipino recipes as well. And, um... As always, guys, like this video, comment down below, share it with your friends and family, subscribe to our channel. And let us know if you want to see more videos like this. Yeah. Like um, cooking videos. If you're new to this channel, welcome. This channel is kind of crazy. It's everywhere right now. We're still trying to figure out what to put out there. But we're glad to have you here. Join our family. Join our journey. And for those of you guys who have been here, we appreciate you as always. Um, we do have a few shout outs. Give me just one second. Um, our first shout out is to, sorry about that, <laughs> I'm looking it up, it's Leah, that was our first shout out, and then our second one, do you remember it? So our next shout out goes to Yahaira es Esquivel, and also to Crystal, what's your last name? Crystal Alvarez? <laughs> it was no? Crystal Relas. Oh, Crystal Relas. Alright, guys. That's it. We love you guys. See you guys next time. Bye bye.